For over two centuries, the U.S. Coast Guard has safeguarded our nation's maritime interests. This includes monitoring the coastline and navigable rivers and waterways in the continental United States, Alaska, Hawaii, Guam, and Puerto Rico. The Coast Guard responds to over 60 search and rescue cases every day, over 20,000 distress calls a year. In the late 1990s, the Coast Guard initiated a program to replace the 1970s National Distress and Response System. This legacy communication system used outdated technology, had numerous dead spots, and didn't allow for simultaneous frequency monitoring. The Coast Guard selected General Dynamics C4 systems to serve as the prime contractor for this new system, Rescue 21. Working with search and rescue mission modernization requirements, General Dynamics worked diligently to significantly improve command and control capabilities by providing enhanced voice clarity and improved voice recording and playback, direction finding capabilities, expanded coverage out to at least 20 nautical miles offshore, and interoperability among federal, state, and local agencies. Working closely with the U.S. Coast Guard, General Dynamics C4 Systems successfully planned and deployed 211 towers, shelters, command centers, and equipment linked across thousands of miles of shoreline and rivers, at different elevations, in varied terrain, with radically different environmental conditions. And together, they provide a seamless network along the Atlantic, Gulf, and Pacific coasts and the Great Lakes. So how does a massive systems integration project such as this happen? First, General Dynamics developed a comprehensive site survey process that would lay the groundwork for each and every site. By conducting risk assessments and running parallel paths, the team facilitated on-time deployment. Next, in the factory, General Dynamics streamlined a system of building, loading, and testing the equipment that would be at each location. This factory build methodology saved time and resources and allowed each Coast Guard sector to be tested in its entirety in a controlled environment. From the factory, General Dynamics deployed the pre-assembled shelters and installed them along with the towers. Each site was unique and each brought its own challenges in building out the Rescue 21 remote fixed facilities. General Dynamics worked closely with federal, state, and local authorities in conjunction with our government customers to ensure regulation compliance throughout the build process. Towers or shelters had to blend in with the surroundings, even if it meant making a tower look like a tree or part of a lighthouse. In parallel, our team completed building modifications and installations at hundreds of Coast Guard facilities, adding the command and control technology for Coast Guard operators to stand the watch using Rescue 21. General Dynamics has perfected an efficient turnkey method to deploy towers, shelters, and needed equipment. Our tailorable processes from the Rescue 21 program can be employed to save time, money, resources, and lives.